Let's just try to get that. So we'll get over this. Get some good speed. Smith grind. Oh. What is up guys? Welcome back to another Skater XL video. Today we're checking out probably my new favorite map called Industrial Zone. It's made by Sean Olive and this place is just amazing. It's not the biggest, but there's just so many ways you can skate here. So I'll just try to do a little tour for you. It does remind me a little bit about Old Factory in Skate 3. And that's not a bad thing. That's one of the cooler places in Skate 3 in my opinion. But you just have so many options left to right. That was actually really cool. Up here you have these three stairs with benches you can skate. And of course we have that beautiful double kink. But you can also skate it up like a euro. This place right here, this stairs, it does remind me a bit about uh, Old Factory. A certain spot in there. But then you also have like down here, you have the rails. You can also skate like a tall ledge, which I totally missed. Here you have a flat gap, but you can also skate this like... Oh man, what's it called? I don't know what it's called in English. Forklift? Is that what it's called? Oh, let's get a trick on that. Just something easy so that we can move on. A sketchy no slide will take it but then from here you can do a gap over to this one to manual and then drop into bank there's just so many options here go up the three and then skate the bench you don't have to pop off up here you have some more three stair stuff and a bench oh narrow challenge oh talking about narrow challenge we got some good stuff I can show you later on over by the king handrail. Here you have some pipes. I don't think they're big enough to skate. I think if you happen to get in there, you're, you're too tall to do anything. Yeah. In the middle here, we have some good open space. I actually like that. But then when we go down here, we have more options to hit. So you could grind this and maybe pop over into the bank or the rails, of course. Let's actually just try that. Okay, I just kind of fell over, but it looked a little bit realistic. You also have a pole jam here which I'm not really too good at skating in this game. You know what? I should probably like Ollie here. Okay. See, that worked. Maybe only two pushes. That looked awesome. Let's just check that out. What? But that was pretty cool though. We also have just a pole that's standing up next to it. I guess you could do some tricks over it into the bank. You can also skate up uh, this might not have been the best place let's just take a look at what's next to this oh, i don't know all these english words but this like car with oily supplies i don't know but you actually seem to have a pretty cool rail that's going out there what i just kind of bailed there okay finally we got it let's skate this bank over here the mellow one we have a little bit steeper one to the other side i think i did some sort of gnarly heel body barrel but i think this one would be a little bit tougher to skate it still works though but you could also gap from one to the other i think it would be the easiest coming from the mellow one okay <laughs> while we get over there again we also have a rail on this side Oh, I did not mean to do that, but that was really awesome. Okay, let's just see if we can get from this one over to that one. I actually went over it, and I think I did like a roll flip somehow. Let's try that again. Nice, really awesome spots. But here's something I really want to skate, which I haven't skated before, because I do take some test runs normally. I did for this video. So I did check out the map a little bit before filming this video. But we have, I think, a ledge that goes into a harbor here, a down ledge, with a small king at the end. You can, of course, also skate that up like I just did. But then to the left of it, backside, you have like a gap to down ledge. Okay, not the cleanest, but we're still just checking out the park. And then over here is just an outlet, I think. Gap to outlet, actually. Oh, nice. And then if we get back a little bit, then we can skate this as a pretty big Euro gap. Or step up, whatever you call it, where you're from. Okay, how would you skate this? Should you just like air over this? Ah, you can also go up it. Okay, let's just do that. We got a switch heel into it, so we'll do a switch flip up it. Not the easiest, but I guess it was all right. And then to the side of it, we have a handrail. Oh, I see a way I want to skate that actually coming from the bump. Because I bet you could gap over there and skate it. But to the right of this pallet, we have 
like an electrical box of some sort that you can skate as an outlet that is really awesome and then here you have this homemade kicker up to the dumpster which i horribly slammed on let's just try to get that so we'll get over this get some good speed smith grind oh i don't think i locked in properly <laughs> Oh no, let's do a nolly pop shove it over. I never nolly pop shove it stuff. And that's why. Whoa. Okay. Let's get the smith grind. Very nice. We actually got a good line here. And then here you could skate this as a ledge and you can get up into a mani, which I failed to do so. But you also have like the perfect handrail to skate over right there. You can skate over this one, land in the bank. You can skate over this weird dumpster thing and also gap the stairs. You have a gap there over ledge, but let's try to hit that bump to rail. But seriously, there are just too many awesome things to skate here in this map. I'll have to do a follow up video, no doubt about it. Let's just check out this bump here. You can easily skate it from a low pop. I think I did a forward triple flip there. Not the most realistic. Let's just get a hard flip. With a bit less speed too little speed our character did not like that but this is too much right yeah then we clear it like crazy i'm having a really bad hard flip day <laughs> it's just not working for me maybe i'd have to do it like the real way where it looks a bit like a front side pressure hard flip i mean we are just having fun skating this awesome park and it's m many many options but I was thinking about skating the handrail like that from the bump. That is actually really cool. Okay. Gapping a little too far out there. I can't really figure out the speed for this. <laughs> I was trying to land in the front board. Or is it a lip at this point? I did it again. But it is a front board, right? Nolly to 70 because this is what I'm landing in if I land in correctly. I'm just spinning into it the other way. Ah, oh, damn it. Maybe we should wind up for this one. Okay, it worked without winding up. Seriously, this map is just amazing. I love everything about it. There are so many creative options. Yeah, okay, that was what I was trying. I think it looked a little weird with my foot movement on the uh, nolly shove it out or nolly big spin out. But yeah, we'll, we'll try to film that. I really don't know what to skate here because there's just, there's too much. There's too many options. Wait, did I go over it? Oh man. <laughs> Is this one of the spots where you can like... Do a heapy flip, but kind of like on the way up. Oh man, that is looking weird. I think I want to get something on the forklift here. And then I want to gap over to this one and do a manual trick. Into the bank here. Okay. And then we also got to do the narrow challenge. We got to get those two before we end this video. Uh... Something is going on with my foot when I get into the crook. Okay, that one didn't, but I also grinded the wrong part of that. See, my foot is like shaking all over the place. See, what is going on here? I think it's because the flick animation might be caught on the forklift. I don't even know if that was a grind. Kick with no slide instead. I mean, it was pretty clean, so I'm just gonna take it because I spent a while on this line now. That could have been filmed better, but overall, I'm pretty happy with that line. I like the snap on that front side flip. Is it called a pallet or a pellet? Or is it not called any of those? <laughs> but look, it even has a broken foot. And me too, apparently.
But let's get up here because it is time for the last thing of this video, which is the narrow challenge. Sean Olive left this ledge and the ledge after it in front of me ungrindable on purpose because you should be able to get up here and ride and then gap from one to the other. This might not be the best time to have the 8.5 board mod on, but hey, we'll give it a go. I gotta turn my board around though. So I think he made this edge so that you can kind of roll with it. Yeah, he did. That is really well made. So stuff like kick flips, heel flips, all these straight flips, they probably would be a little easier than trying something like a pop shove it or tray flip, hard flip, barrel heel, stuff like that. You get what I'm saying. I think a tray flip would be really cool. This is so difficult. Oh man, I feel like that was almost it. Okay guys, I've been trying this for way too long, so I'm gonna do something easier just to film a clip on this because it's a really awesome spot. But I challenge you guys to get a tray flip here and the first one that does it and post it in the Skater Excel channel in my Discord gets a shout out in a future video. So I finally got something on it worth filming. I feel like that nollie flip looked pretty cool, but I'm sure you guys can do a lot better. So if you happen to get the tray flip and you're the first one to upload it in my Skater XL channel in my own Discord, I will give you a shout out in a future video. So I hope the map is up by now or at least very soon so you guys can try this challenge out and just skate this really awesome map. Big props to Sean Olive because this place is absolutely amazing. And as I said, probably my new favorite spot of this game, or favorite map in general, because there are like a thousand spots here. But if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like. That really helps me out with the YouTube algorithm and all that. And then I'll just see you guys in the next video. So until then, peace.